Hi folks and welcome to Masterclass. Today I'm gonna to show you how to do repairs on your tent and the three materials in your tent. That's the canvas, the fly screen and the PVC floor. And how we're gonna do that is with this product called Stormshore. It is a great product if you're out, if you've got a tent top trailer or using a tent, this is something you should always carry with you. It's a very quick, very easy and waterproof repair. So for starters, I'm gonna show you how to repair canvas and two types of repairs. One is a tear and the other one is a hole. Really easy to do. So what you'll need is some tape. So keep a roll of tape with you as well because we need to put a backing on that hole before we repair it. So easy to do, take a section of tape, put it over the hole and now all we need to do is apply our storm shore. So come in, get a closer look, and I'll show you how to do it. So with your storm shore, re remove the cap, turn the cap around, and use the little pin in there to pierce the tube. Now, what we need to do is apply it over this hole. So work it out over the edges, make sure it overlaps onto the canvas. Now we can return our cap. And what that'll do, that makes a membrane seal it over there. It will adhere really well to the canvas. And when we're done, we simply peel our tape off the back once the storm shore is dry. With this repair, we have a cut in our tent. So what we do, lay it out, get it flat. If it's on a vertical surface, it might pay to get someone to put a backing board or something behind it. Or if you have to apply some tape over it to keep it together. And again, we just apply our storm shore straight over it. Make sure there's a bit of overlap on the canvas either side of the cut. Now we can return our cap, allow the storm shore to cure and that will be our repair done it will be waterproof and strong enough to hold that canvas together. Now we have a mesh repair. It's quite often people will damage their mesh on their trailers. Easy way to do it is, ta again, tape over it. That'll hold the mesh together. And again, apply our storm shore with a bit of overlap either side of the cut. Work it into the mesh a little bit. Same with holes, just as you do with canvas, if you get a, a round hole in it, or odd shaped hole tape over it and then put a membrane layer of the storm shore over the top. Now we can let that cure and it will be a very, very strong repair. If you need to do a repair in your PVC floor in your tent or annex, exactly the same method. So if you have a hole or a cut, repair it exactly the same way as we did with the mesh and the canvas. And that repair again will be waterproof. With PVC floors, if you're set up on rocky surfaces, if there's loose pebble sticks when you lay out the floor, the chances are when you walk on them, you are actually going to pierce the plastic. It's not as strong as a timber floor, of course. So you need to take good care of your PVC floors. If you're camping out in the bush, there's sticks, rocks, maybe rake it first or put down a tarp to add some protection underneath the PVC floor. So when you walk on it with the weight of you, you're not actually piercing it with rocks and twigs underneath. That's it folks, Storm Shore is so easy to put on. Always keep it in your kit. It can mean the difference between drips into your camper and no drips at all, should you damage it. For more information, some great tips, go to our YouTube channel and follow the Masterclass series and definitely follow us on Facebook and you'll see each episode as it's available.